he had the Lil Wayne statement, right? <laughs> so I was Alonzo type, but like, oh shit, hey, you <laughs> gotta come with me. For, uh, forgive me for the delay. Oh shit. Um, the delay on, you know, just the delay. I want to say uh, I had the first bus to get strength. I had to get strength enough to do this without breaking. Um, I must say thank you. I must say thank you to every voice, every opinion, all the care, all the love, and the support out there. It's, your, your words turn into to arms and, and held me up when, when I try to fall back. Um, that hurt. Hurt a lot. You know what I'm talking about? It hurt a whole lot. Um, I blame myself for not being mentally prepared for a letdown. And for just automatically mentally putting myself in that position like somebody told me that was my position. So I blame myself for that. But. I thought that was nothing, you know, I thought that was nothing better than that, that, that spot, you know, stage, and that platform in my city. And, um, so it hurt, it hurt a whole lot. Um, but y'all, y'all are fucking amazing. It made me feel like shit when I did this, this opportunity. And when I felt like shit, you guys reminded me that I ain't shit without y'all. And, and that's an amazing reality. So, like I said, it broke me, and I'm just trying to put me back together. But my God, have you all helped me? Thanks to all my peers, my friends, my family, and my homies on sports television, everybody repping me. I really appreciate that. I really do. I feel like I let all of y'all down by not getting that opportunity. But I'm working on me, and I'm working. So thank you. Little Wayne, Wheezy, a baby. It's real unfortunate. Do you know what else is more unfortunate? I feel your pain too. It's unfortunate, Lil Wayne. It's unfortunate. <sighs> I still love you, Wayne. Pause, no diddy. Look, look. I'm I'm gonna work out to card of one right now. I'm gonna go to the gym after this. I'm man. I'm going to. I'm listening to the Carter man. Carter, Carter, Carter. I'm gonna go listen to. Can't feel my face with you and uh uh, uh Jewel Santana, the uh Black Republican song. That's one of my favorite ones. I think you did better than Jay Z and Nas, if you ask me. I like y'all. I like Little Wayne and Jewel Santana version than Nas and Jay Z, if you ask me. But you trash at performing though. Like you suck. Like you're not good. Like pretty bad. But I'm gonna listen to you when I'm working out though. But you suck. I <clears throat> Once again, I ain't gonna lie, man. I, I got I'm gonna have to pour some more liquor because I'm just yeah. just giving it up raw tonight. I ain't gonna lie, pause, no diddy. Really, no diddy. Yo, yo, Wayne, I ain't gonna lie, bro. This you is goddamn fucking pathetic, bro. I gotta keep it being. I love Wayne. You but suck. Wayne, somebody gonna have to tell you the truth, and I don't know if it's me or somebody else, but somebody gotta tell you the truth. You suck. The, the, the reason why you're broken, nigga, is because, nigga, you haven't given a fuck in a good couple of years. We do love you, and the fans do love you, and you are a legend, but God damn it, nigga. Let me tell you, you're like the old uncle that shows up to the cookout, and everybody talk about you behind your back, but nobody wanna tell you what yeah. the fuck we've been talking about, so I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. Wayne, they say you suck at performing, my nigga. They you say you don't remember your lyrics. Yeah, you got great songs, but they say you suck. Literally. That's all they say. You, you suck. T terrible. Listen, this is one of the times I got to agree with academics. Look, this is. Lil Wayne, basically what he's trying to tell you. Listen, let me say something to you as a friend. Mm -hmm. Lil Wayne, we just want to tell you this as a friend. You suck. You suck. Right? Mm -hmm. The reason you can't get work 
it's not because people don't like you, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's not because people don't want to give you a chance. Yeah. It's because you suck. <laughs> you suck, little Wayne. Pause. But you're trash. It, it, it's not like you're not a good rapper. It, it's not like we don't like your songs. You, you suck. <laughs> no? You're not funny. <laughs> you suck. You, you suck. <laughs> All right? You suck. Pause. Nigga, you're trash. I'm sorry to say, they say yes. garbage. That's, the, 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 that's one thing. Yes. Now, do I believe you deserve to perform? Or you were off deserving to, to be performing at the Super Bowl headline <laughs> in your city? Yes. But uh, not only does that first point that you fucking suck at performing currently yes. matter, the mm -hmm. next point matters that I'm about to make too. And I do love you. This is tough love. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I get it. You're a I legend. Agree. You've given us so much. Yeah, you know, yeah. by the way, ever since you had that health scare where we thought we've given you a lot of grace. But here's yeah, the thing, yeah, and here's the reality yeah. of it. Gotta be real now. Wait. Gotta be real. You suffer from a severe case of not giving a fuck. And when a nigga don't give a fuck, he can't wake up to great things just falling in his lap. I love you, ain't. But my uh, nigga, you yeah. gotta go watch what Usher did to go get a Super Bowl performance. And you yeah. are in the Usher category, brother. Yeah. yeah, yeah. A legend. A living yeah. legend who's yeah. still active. Yeah. yeah. Mount Rushmore type. But you know what that nigga had to go do? That nigga had to go to goddamn Vegas, do all type of residency days. He even says he stayed there for months like the nigga was putting in work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even know if Wayne could successfully finish a tour and perform all his songs either word for word or even yeah, yeah. Bro, that's the reality of it right like you know yeah, clearly yeah, yeah. I want him to get this this opportunity but but Wayne gotta stop playing victim right here yeah, yeah. they're saying you suck at performing right now you need to get better yeah, this whole yeah. thing like oh I got I rap too many shit I don't remember my lyrics that ain't gonna cut it brother no, we ain't gonna cut it nigga nice, nigga bring right. a pen and a paper out, uh, out to your performance so you can read it off there nigga yeah. read it off matter of fact you know what somebody I seen him pop up at Drake's show at the motherfucking Prudential Center you know what somebody quickly pointed out to me they say yo those monitors around the stage that's for when Wayne comes out that he can look at his lyrics right there I said what the fuck Damn. that's a fucking problem if you can't remember your goddamn lyrics like what are we talking about so that's number one, you need to fix that. Number two, you gotta start giving a fuck about this shit, brother. I'm sorry to say, my nigga. You, the, the, the reason why you Kobe, and the reason why I think Drake surpassed you, and really Drake is the one comparing with Jay Nachu, competing with Jay Nachu, even though you've had a phenomenal career and we do love you, is because you've shown time and time again you don't give a fuck. That's just the reality of it, bro. Like, my nigga, like, bro, the nigga made a video saying, I'm surprised I wasn't picked. Well, nigga, here's the, here's the funny part about it. Nigga, they picked Kendrick like over a month ago. Like, this is how you know he's not tapped in. This is how you know he doesn't give a fuck. They told the nigga a month ago, he had to shoot a video a month ago. Which, or, or like he was told he had to shoot a video a month ago. He, he shot the video supposedly like a week ago, or not a week, two weeks ago or something like that. But it was after Drake did some of the week two shit, or no, no, the, the uh, round two shit. Damn. But the nigga knew a month ago. Damn. So if you find it out on TV, it tells me you're not giving a fuck personality. Damn. Things that a Super Bowl headline performance is going to fall in your lap, which is just not going to. Damn, that, that is a good point. He, he, he didn't find out until Kendrick announced it. Man, that is a good point. That is kind of fucked up. Damn, this is this is one of the times where I gotta agree with academics. Ah, shit. What happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to start giving. Is that what I Fuck that You got to start giving a fuck. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm serious. Yeah, me and too. I'm, I'm not saying any of these things. Uh, I, I kind of to clown agree. Wayne because like I think that's the saddest part about it all we all love Wayne yeah. we all make excuses for Wayne yeah. Yeah. Wayne went through a health scare these days when we look at Wayne we just gotta be very clear chat like I know I know we gotta be very clear yeah. when I look at Wayne these days I be like yo I'm glad he's looking sober yeah. like let's be honest right like we're, we're like we're, we're getting like these little trinkets of oh yeah no no he's looking sober oh damn yeah, that's that, that, that is the thing we've been like oh damn he's Looking good, like good, meaning he's not on drugs. That's like when people say, oh, Wayne looking good. That's what that's what you say to a person that's, you know. <sighs> yeah, yeah, you know, I got to got to agree on that, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Like, again, yeah. I think Wayne has a lot of work to do on himself and he still has work to do, not necessarily in terms of catalog with his career, yeah. but being a legacy act, you got to you gotta at least present yourself a certain way my brother yeah. like you shouldn't be just showing up picking up a mic like this is your first year on the job of being a performer yeah that's why they're not picking you 
Yeah. Did you see how that motherfucker Kendrick came out to that when he was just a guest appearance during um 2022? Was it 2022? Nigga had soldiers with him. They got chore. They were doing choreography. Like, come on, bro. Don't gaslight us and, and like, yeah, we want you to get it. Like, bro, you deserve it. You're like, you're, you're one of the greatest. Yeah. We want you to get it. Yeah. But it would be a disservice if we just said that you didn't have to present yourself in a certain way just because you got to this point. This isn't a lifetime achievement award. This isn't like some type of, oh, okay, great. You, your career was good. So just give it to them. Like, yeah. Yeah. yo, niggas is showing multiple performance where they say you can't remember your lyrics, your performance is trash. Okay, so that's one thing. Number two, they say you're not even, like a lot of these things, you got to pitch to these people. You got to, you got to put on an exhibition that you are the suitable candidate. You gotta be in contact with these people. Mm. You clearly, like, I'm gonna fall back from the, oh, you and Jay-Z got an issue, but if, if that's the case, Jay-Z's one of the influential people that's making the pick. Show the nigga something. I'm pretty sure he would've picked you. Maybe not this year, because I don't think you want Drake getting no shine, but come on, bro, you can do better, bro. Like, like, like we gotta give Wayne a little tough love. Like, you know, yeah. again, yeah. We, we give Wayne a lot of passes, but yeah, we do. Wayne, we nigga's do. saying you can't even remember your lyrics, bro. Like, come on, bro. Yeah. Respectfully, bro. Pretty bad. That's a problem. Yeah. Trust me, I hated even criticizing Wayne because I do love Wayne. Yeah. And, I, and, and, and me criticizing him feels like, it just yeah. feels blasphemous. So I apologize as much as I'm, but, it, but it's kind of true. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wayne, you got to do a little bit more effort, bro. Please, bro. Please, yeah, dog. He do, he do. Please, he do. please. Okay. Uh, next topic real quick. Man. All right, y'all. We're going to leave on that note. Sometimes we got to save them from themselves. I don't want to see Lil Wayne Super Bowl like this. No, yeah, yeah, I'm I'm glad he's not invited. I'm not even, I, I would be embarrassed. I, I I'll be like, "No, man, somebody cut the mic off. Turn the lights off. Somebody somebody cut the cord." Nah, nah, man. Sometimes the best help is to help them from themselves. So we we got to help Lil Wayne from himself. I don't want to see you out there in the Super Bowl like this, man. Nah, bro. Nah, you nah, bro. You can't come out to. The Listen, let me say something to you, as a friend. You suck. <laughs> right? The reason you can't get work, it's not because people don't like you, man. You know, it's not because people don't want to give you a chance. It's because you suck. <laughs> you know? You're not funny. <laughs> you suck. All right, y'all. I'm out of here, man. Salute to y'all. Please hit that like button on your way out. <sighs> man, let's just pray for Lil Wayne, man. Come on, Lil Wayne. It ain't, man, come on, man. You got to get yourself together, brother. Got to get yourself together, man. Every day we 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 are losing our legends, man. Man, I would, just all jokes aside, bro, I would flip my mind if I wake up one day and we hear Lil Wayne overdose on something, man. Like, for real, like, all jokes aside, man, that, that'd that be a, a very sad day, man. And I don't, I don't want Wayne to go through that, man. Like, come on, Wayne, man. You got to get yourself together, brother. All right. Uh, cause you, man, we are, we are losing our legends literally like seem like every month, every month seem like we are losing our legends, man. So like all jokes aside, man, definitely, definitely pray out for Wayne. You know what I mean? And, 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 uh, you know, I, I, I don't know his personal life, but just from the outside looking in, it just, it just don't look good. It just don't look good, man. So, you know, uh, but other than that, man, salute to everybody in the 